boulders, the old, the fragile looking boulders, the ones that look all cur uh, like, what did you say, they look like a volcanic stone, full of holes. lot of the stuff I wouldn't have known how to do, but, uh, ooh, I like that centaur. Pretty cool. Reminds me of the, uh, first boss in Actraiser. And now, people! If I can go back to uh, before I turn the machine on, I want to uh, see if I could turn the other machine on, or if I need to get all the biomass maxed out before I can turn that one on, because if so, I'm definitely going to do that. Because I'm actually very interested. Once over coffee, huh? Tiger style. And the game's only 78% complete. See, so yeah, I did it like an hour faster with 3,000 less biomass. See if I could turn the other one on, or if we need more juice for that. So what now? They're waiting. Yep, 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 yep. Hmm. Skip, so skip, 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 skip. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yep. Okay. We just listened to, to, listen to this like three minutes now. ago. Core power is high enough. Okay, I'm going to see if I can turn the other one on, and if not, this monument is not yet powered. Must raise core power even higher. Alert! A harvester contributes two units of core power when its chamber is. We at biomass we know our. Four. Thank you. It contributes four units at biomass five. I have developed this interface to expose core power to you. This interface is contained on your map. Core power forty four. Maxed out. Power station not maxed out. Devil Islands not maxed out. So, we've met the sentience, we've uh, juiced the power core up. How long have I been going? About an hour. Hmm, just a random lava pool, sure. Nope. You're going the wrong way. Alright, go that way. Brain there. <laughs> and I don't know if this is a good one. He will keep spitting seeds out pretty much the whole time, and they'll just keep falling into the lava. So when the other, the flying guys wake up, they will make good use of him, because they'll be catching those seeds. I think your seeds uh, fall down into this pocket. 
Maybe not. I'm going to make use of you. Give me. Thank you. Ouch. Monsters in this game are rude. I just want to put that out there. Rude monsters. Actually, talk to her very much re in a while, so let's do that. We'll talk to her a few times. Lonnie, how did you discover the signal? But so many scientists on Earth have scrutinized the cave without noticing it. Well, you can't blame them. Even if it were a conventional FHSS encoding, it still would have looked like background noise. The trick was that Octo found it first. I programmed him to search for patterns in his input data. Any search he could dream of. I thought if we found life on Mars, it would be nothing like life on Earth. So we needed Octo to look in ways even we weren't thinking of. Boy, was I wrong about that. But it did help Octo find the signal. When I saw he used that scanning subroutine, I knew something was up. So I poured over all the readings coming from that location until I found it. You programmed Octo to search for patterns. But you were not on that development team. Oh. Am I invisible? Oh, I fell. Let me out! Ah! And then, whoa, that's what happened. She cut communication. You are rude! Stop shooting in that direction. In fact, I am going to stop you from shooting in, at all for a while. Take that. Is there something you should tell me about Octo? Oh, yeah. I think he left behind those cameras so he could maintain contact with the surface. Or maybe as a trail for us to follow, since he left them at interesting locations we'd probably visit. How is it that you programmed Octo when you were not on the Octo development team? Oh, yikes. You're not gonna let that go, huh? Oh, I'm gonna be in so much trouble. Look, the project director sanctioned it, but... We haven't found Octo yet. I really hope you find him. If his data is valuable enough, then maybe it will have been worth it. Kind of a big deal since uh, the AI seem to be fairly intelligent and free thinking now. You wouldn't want to abuse them. Get on the wrong side of the AI council. Anything else, you guys? Here's my big question. Suppose ancient Mars really did support life on the surface. Oceans, atmosphere, life forms evolving over time, all that. Why is it such a bare rock today? Perhaps the atmosphere disappeared first. The rest would soon topple. The oceans would evaporate into space and be subsumed underground. The surface would become cold and blasted with radiation. Which is pretty much the Mars we see today. So, what happened to the atmosphere? The only reason Earth has an atmosphere is because of its liquid core. Convection of that molten metal creates the magnetic field. And the magnetic field deflects the sun's solar wind, which would otherwise blast Earth's atmosphere into space. See where I'm going with this? If Mars once had a molten core of significant size, it might have been able to sustain an atmosphere until that molten core cooled. At which point, the whole planet would have become barren and dead, slowly, over centuries. Interesting. Well, that's enough of that for now. Let's uh, see if we can actually finish raising the biomass in this chamber before I stop for the uh, this time period. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna use these guys. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey! And everyone wakes up. Aww. Oh, well, that.
that works. Give me this. Thank you. More seeds for the seed hoard. And please heal my grievous open bleeding wounds. Thank you. this compost for? Well, I mean, it's obvious what I can use it for, but uh, what is the most optimum use of my compost? That's the question. I would really like to get uh, two plants with uh, one stone, as it were. Also, this guy's not doing much. Yeah, mine. I do believe this path goes to uh, an area that I'm I rather like, but we'll have to wait on that. Oh yeah, I don't think I've done this yet. Yep, magma suppression. And now hazard research is complete. Complete, 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 not complete, 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 not complete, complete, not complete, complete, not complete. Well, we've gotten a lot of research under our belt, but uh, not quite enough. <sighs> no, you're supposed to jump. would be plus 30 if I used it there. Which uh, might be the best deal I'm going to get. I think I'm going to use it there. You praxis, man. Right here, we'll get them both. Well, it helps if I actually throw it. Yep. Perfect. Now what I need is just a bunch of uh, compost. Or I could use a bunch of these. Hey, guy. Leave me alone! I'm on your side! I leave these as peace offerings. Now, please don't hurt me.
another one is born. Biomass four, which means it's making two power. left yes there are a couple this up to the maximum level will probably mean force feeding these guys a bunch. Where have I left a bunch of uh, green seeds? Crossing? I mean, if you just wait long enough, the seeds should come back, I do believe. Oh wait, no, they only come back if they've uh, gone missing. The seeds are spawned, then they aren't coming back. They won't uh, make more seeds, that is. But this little pocket down here seems to collect a lot of them, like ridiculous quantities. So I can do that. Just keep popping in back and forth between those two places. I know. I can chat with Amani. My uh, goal right now, though, is uh, to feed those... these guys. These squiggly, bacteria-looking guys. And no one's in here, which is convenient. short two now. Okay, back to the crossing. Where I will pick up eight seeds and then... Uh, I guess I'll pick up a little more than eight. Give me those. I want the blue seeds. Nothing a little biological uh, relocation can't cure. Nope. Nope. Gotta try harder than that, Prax. Come on. One more. There you go. Good job. How much 
power am I making now? 48. You know, I bet 50 is the goal. Let me just grab these things again. Fine. And yes, getting more blue seeds is as easy as transitioning areas back and forth really quick. things off, let's have a little chat with Amani before I uh, take off. Uh, okay, there. I feel better. Hey, guys. I actually can't think of anything else I'm dying to talk to you about right now. I am sure more topics will arise as we explore further. We can just make conversation if you want. People do that, you know. Okay, I guess there is nothing le left to talk to Amani about. Well, I'll grab some compost so I will not have wasted my time. They don't, yeah, that's right, they don't hatch when biomass is full. I forgot. That is my bad. Okay, so uh, this will have to do for now, guys. We saw one of the endings, and I'm uh, working on getting the other one. Next time, I think we'll check out the Chamber of Echoes and the area it connects to, then perhaps the Devil Islands, before we uh, head to the power station and uh, see what's over here to the left. An area I like, I think, I, if I remember correctly. But anyway, you all take care, all right? I will talk to you next time. <sighs> Yawn. Bye-bye for now, all right? See y'all later.